Hey, this is uh, Carlton. I was just going to um, give my little two cents into this whole thing. I have an idea of how to implement a program. As you can see, I'm a veteran and um, fourth generation veteran. I uh, don't really appreciate, you know, the disrespect of the flag. I really don't appreciate it. Um, here's how we do this, okay? Um, the idea is if I understand social injustice, got it. I don't want that either. Nobody wants uh, people to be treated unjust, period. So here's how we fix this. And this is me talking from personal experience. Uh, in police departments, uh, when a police officer commits an injustice to a citizen, there's this department called Internal Affairs. And Internal Affairs is basically the police department, uh, different officers get rotated onto this thing called Internal Affairs to, uh, it's kind of like uh, in the military, we call it, oh, we, you got to go do guard duty. So once officer gets on there, uh, they investigate different cases and they rotate out. So basically, long story short, they're investigating themselves. They keep rotating through internal affairs. Now, that doesn't make any sense, even though, yeah, like I talked to our local sheriff about this years ago, and he was like, listen, uh, our officers are good. Yeah, that's that's in fairy tale land. Um, 90, uh, uh, hopefully the majority of officers, it's that old saying, uh, you get one bad apple, it ruins a whole bunch. Majority of officers want to do the right thing. So here's how this works. You eliminate internal affairs because they're investigating themselves when there's a wrong. And we take that money. That's department's cut. Bam. Done. It should be a, uh, a local, state level, or it could be a federal level. And we create what's called the Citizens Accountability Department, where when a citizen has an injust against... Um, against them, they immediately file a complaint. The complaint is investigated and there is no like fraternization between uh, the Citizens Department of Accountability and the Police Department whatsoever. If there is, uh, there's consequences for those actions. And I'll tell you the reason why we, we need to do this. Because one, from personal experience, uh, I was assaulted. Uh, this is if about eight years ago, I was pushed in a ditch out in front of my house by a couple neighbors. I defended myself. I used pepper spray. Uh, immediately came inside, got a video camera, video camera, me telling the officer exactly what happened. That officer, um, one of the, the people who uh, was assaulting me, daughter is a police officer, a sergeant on the police department. So what happened was... Uh, that officer, the, the reporting officer, left information out. Then when it got to the detective, the detective left even more information out, arrested me for two counts of assault as if I was just walking down the street and I sprayed two people with pepper spray, which was not the case. Um, it, I immediately, when I figured out, oh, the officer, reporting officer left information out, uh, and then the detective did that, I filed a... Um, I've I filed a complaint with Internal Affairs because that's wrong. Well, they're, well, of course, when I filed it, they're like, oh, you got to wait for it to go through tr the jury trial. Well, it should have never went to trial. If we had a separate department that would investigate it, they would have said, oh, look, we see what's going on that's wrong. And they would have went to the judge and said, hey, judge, this is what's going on. The reporting officer left information out. The detective left way more information out. This should have never been an arrest, period, 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 period. Matter of fact, I was assaulted first. That person never got arrested because their uh, friend is a, a, a member on the police department. That's wrong. I'm a, uh, obviously a white guy uh, from a family of means. can only imagine from minorities and the African-American community and people that don't have money. So, long story short, disband internal affairs, start the Citizens Accountability Department, which is separate, can be made up of an attorney and some other uh, legal professionals that's not associated with the police department. It's a great idea. It would hold the police departments accountable, period. And they no longer investigate themselves for um, injustice against citizens.
This is Carlton. Later. Oh, by the way, don't disrespect the flag, man. Because uh, I'm a fourth generation and veteran, and that's not cool.